Hi everybody, Jeremy here from Video Editor Studio and today I'd like to share with you a shortcut that I use all the time when I'm editing. So let's check it out. All right, so in DaVinci Resolve right now on the edit page, and as you can see here, I've put together a quick sequence from a trip I've done back uh, in Vietnam. And here, as you can see, I've edited it to the music and I've cut uh, all the shot to the beat by using a marker. I've used here the shortcut M to leave a marker on each uh, drum of this music. And that's where I'm basically gonna make my cut. But that's not the shortcut that I want to share with you. The shortcut is sometimes I finish to edit uh, my sequence. I'm happy with it, but I realized like, hmm, actually I should swap like two shots. It doesn't really work. Uh, I think one should be uh, like another spot. And uh, the way to go about it, usually you would uh, just take your shot, put it on top of the other one, move the other one, and just like, try to slide it in like that, all right? Uh, which doesn't seem to be the more efficient way to go about it, especially if you're not zooming in the timeline. And here, as you can see, there is a tiny gap in between the clip and uh, that might cause some trouble. You may have like all the track busy with other element and erase them by just putting them on top. So it's not the optimal way to go about it. So let's reverse back to uh, the original uh, video. What I usually do when I'm in that scenario and I want to swap clip is I'm just selecting the clip that I want to swap. And here I'm gonna use the shortcut Shift, Command and Comma. If I want to swap the clip to the left, I'm gonna do Shift, Command and Full Stop if I want to swap that clip on the right. You can also do that for multiple clips at the time. So here, if I want to replace, for example, that entire sequence, you could select everything and then it shift command and comma and I can just drag everything past this clip. I could just do that for multiple clip again and again and again to bring that over to the top. So here shift command and comma and just bring that, bring that, bring that and now everything at the front. So right now you see it moved my music because uh, I arrived at the beginning and here I can put it back in place with shift command and dot and just moving it back to where it was originally. And then if you moved your clip, you know, and uh, it's not landing on the bit properly, you can just make micro adjustment to make sure that everything is landing here on your marker when you made uh, your modification. I have another full video about how to edit properly to the bit using marker. You can find this video uh, with a link in the description below. I hope these tips was helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next one. Bye. Speed up your workflow and create better videos using the pack available on our website, including titles, transition, and templates, but only for DaVinci Resolve. Get started today by downloading our free starter pack containing a compilation of 20 titles curated from our library. Link in the description below or at videodigitalstudio.com.